Normally, when you add a table to a Word document by either dragging out a grid or by using the insert table command, the table you create automatically expands to the width of your document with equally sized rows and columns. You can then change the widths and heights by customizing the table settings under the Layout tab. But a quick way to immediately get more control of your table's proportions is to draw it by hand. In the Insert ribbon, click the Table button and select Draw Table. That turns your mouse cursor into a pencil icon. First, draw the outer border of your table. Just drag out a rectangle. You can then draw the lines for individual rows and columns. The advantage here is that you can manually create the size of your rows and columns. The table you draw behaves just like any other table in your document. You can adjust its properties under the Layout tab, you can add more rows and columns, and you can even select the Draw Table button again to add more cells to your table or to split individual cells. You can even drag diagonal lines if necessary. Learn more about Word or browse our entire library of courses at linkedin.com learning.